Hey guys, and welcome back to another NBC video. Uh, it's been a little bit since our uh, last video once again. Uh, sorry about that. But uh, there's actually a reason for that, and uh, that's why I'm here uh, sitting down uh, just in front of my garage here uh, to let you guys know that our YouTube channel got not only one, but two channel strikes for what I honestly believe to be some of the stupidest reasons ever. And, uh, I don't know, this YouTube video may get flagged too for just for me calling out YouTube, but it needs to be said because there's, uh, it's been going on long enough and it's happened to multiple people. And, uh, so I just kind of want to get it off my chest and let you guys know why we've kind of been MIA, uh, recently. So, first off, YouTube has, uh, removed two of our videos now. The first one was of our grandpa's 2002 Ford F-150 King Ranch, uh, the startup and tour video that Ethan did uh, of it, and uh, that also said in the title, Ethan Drives, um, and it was clips of Ethan uh, driving the truck out in our uh, field behind our aunt's old house. Nobody else was out there. It was a closed course, so he. that's why YouTube flagged it. Uh, according to them, it was goes against their child safety policy because back then it was when Ethan was a little bit younger. Um, and so, of course, he was 15 in the video. He had his temps. Or he may not have had his temps at that time, but he was very close to getting his temps. Regardless, it was off the road. It was in a backyard. And where we live around here that's just normal things and i'm sure it's normal in other parts of the country too in rural areas it's just normal for kids to drive vehicles off the road on their own property so first that doesn't make any sense to me how it's child endangerment when my grandpa was literally in the front seat with him and i was in the back seat we both were there the whole time they had everything under control it just it doesn't make any sense to me but regardless, that's why YouTube removed it for child going against their child safety policy. And uh, so, I don't agree with it, but I guess I can see where they're coming from with that video. Now, the second video that got removed was the test drive of my 2006 Chevy Trailblazer that I was driving. Mind you, I was 16, 17 years old at the time of this video. Perfectly legal to dr be driving. And Ethan was in the passenger seat filming. And YouTube flagged this video, gave us a second, another channel strike, and said that that was child, goes against the uh, child safety policy for child endangerment as well. When all Ethan was doing was sitting in the passenger seat filming me. That makes zero sense to me. Absolutely zero sense why that video would be removed. And why YouTube is coming after our small channel. That was one of our best viewed videos. And it's gone off of YouTube now. Because of BS reasons for them taking it down. So yeah, the second one really, uh, it really grinds my gears that that one was taken down. There was absolutely zero reason to. I tried to appeal the process. And of course YouTube said they were going to stick with their uh, decision to remove our video. But of course, you know it's nobody actually looking at these videos. It's a uh, computerized system. Nobody, a physical person, as far as I know, at YouTube does not look at these videos and see what's actually going on in them. They have a system, and if the system flags something, then you're pretty much done for because they, nobody else is going to be looking at it. So, like I said, I could see their reasoning possibly in the first video sure so i wasn't too terribly upset about that but the one of my trailblazer where i was driving and ethan was filming and we weren't doing anything wrong to take that down and give us another channel strike and then so when you get a first channel strike it's just a warning there's no penalty no nothing you can still upload videos but when you get another channel strike after you've gotten the first one then you cannot upload for five days. So this was shortly after our EAA Oshkosh video came out. And uh, so I couldn't upload. I couldn't upload for five days and I had videos planned to upload. Um, 
I have since not had the time to film. At that time I did, but I couldn't upload the videos. So, very frustrating by YouTube. And like I said, I know this has happened to even bigger channels, but why YouTube's coming after our small channel? And those videos have been on YouTube for three, four years. I don't understand why all of a sudden now it's a problem. So like I said, it doesn't make any sense. I digress anyway. But I just want to let you guys know what the deal was. And uh, I think the channel strikes go away in 90 days and then you start over fresh. But literally, if we get three channel strikes, YouTube will delete all our videos and our channel. And that is something I don't want to happen. So, I haven't taken any other videos down since. And YouTube hasn't flagged any other videos since. And it's been about a month now, probably, uh, since this all happened. So, fingers crossed that uh, nothing else happens. But uh, I'm, we'll update you guys if anything does. Alright guys, well, I didn't want to leave this, end this video on a sour note. Uh, but I just want to say one more thing. If uh, anybody at YouTube is watching this video, which I doubt you are, but it, anyway, if you happen to see this, please do better and uh, try to make your policies and how your policies are um, monitored a uh, much better system because uh, it's it's been a problem for a long time and it really needs to be addressed. Okay, so now switching gears, like I said, so I don't have to end on such a sour note. I wanted to show you guys uh, this here. Which is our uh, Sun Dolphin uh, 5 person paddle boat. And uh, we've actually had this paddle boat for quite a few years now. Um, I think want to say we got it in like 2016 summer. So we've had it for quite a while. Um, I have never showed it on the channel. Because it kind of was just something that uh, we used uh, pleasurely whenever we wanted to. But uh, recently this summer I got uh, the uh, trailer that it's sitting on. I'll give you a little look there and uh, I got this trailer so um because we used to just haul it on the black trailer that my uh, grandpa has but I got this trailer uh, because this one can be backed um, into the water and then I can back the boat right in and it'll float off and then it'll be easier to load and unload and uh, so yeah we haven't used this uh, paddle boat all that much since we've had it honestly but uh, we did use it a little bit this summer so yeah uh when i got the trailer it didn't have any of this wood or uh carpet on here uh, i put the, that on there uh, and i also did not have this uh winch uh mechanism here that i designed uh for it so uh yeah i got all that on there and uh the last time we took it out when i had everything uh done like this it worked great so yeah, just wanted to show you guys that. That's kind of something I had been up to this summer. I never really filmed it much. I uh, just kind of did it. And also, just wanted to update you guys. We stu do still have the uh, 2005 Forest Street style. Uh, we got branches growing on top of it right now. But uh, I am looking this fall to uh, start working on this again. Uh, last fall, I uh, made the first video on this. And then I just kind of got busy with school and stuff. I, of course, don't have to go to school anymore now, so uh, I will have more time to work on this. Uh, I'm going to work on getting it cleaned out and uh, making it smell better inside. And uh, we'll see what we do with this thing. I'm not entirely sure. Um, but, uh, yeah, I do still plan on doing a few things to the old uh, Ford Freestyle. Then, of course, we have uh, Project Ford Explorer, our uh, rebuild on the channel uh, that Ethan has been driving, of course. And uh, it's not here today, otherwise I'd show it to you guys. But uh, we also will have, I've been saying it for a while now, but I will be getting out a, uh, just like an update video on that. Uh, a lot of the things that have been replaced on that recently, uh, we didn't do ourselves, it went to a shop. But we'll, uh, we'll go over, over everything that was replaced on it uh, in that video. So uh, stay tuned for that. And finally, we have one more exciting thing to show you guys, um, which will be another video coming out. But I'm not going to say any more about that today because I'm going to wait until uh, Ethan is home for that because uh, it is something that he has gotten. And uh, you guys probably can maybe guess along the lines of what it is. But uh, like, I'm not going to say anything more about that right now. So uh, if you're curious about that, please uh, subscribe to our channel so you can uh, see that video when it comes out. 
and uh, search our channel and please subscribe and uh, we'll see you next time on NBC. Thanks for watching everybody.